last week we made some puppets and this week we're going to make some more. I think puppets are really awesome because you can use them to tell a story and I think they're really fun to make. But the thing about puppets is they don't just work on their own, right? I can't just put this guy down on the floor and say, walk. And I can't just look at him and say, talk. He's not going to say anything and he's not going to do anything unless I use the power of my hands or my voice to make it look like he's walking or that he is talking. This reminds me of today's story where we see a miracle occur. Now a miracle is something that happens that's amazing and extraordinary and it happens through God's power. So have a listen to the story and then I'll explain why this reminds me of today's story. At three in the afternoon, Peter and John went to the temple because that was the time to pray. A man who couldn't walk was being carried to the temple gates so that he could ask for money. He asked Peter and John for some money. They said, look at us, and he did, thinking that they would give him some money. But then they did something unexpected. They said, we don't have any money, but in the name of Jesus, walk. And guess what happened? The man got up and he walked and then he jumped and he praised God. Everyone around thought this was so amazing too. The power of the Holy Spirit allowed him to walk and praise God, just like I needed to use my hand to give the puppet the power to talk and walk. Just like a puppet needs us to use the power of our hands in order to make them move, um, the man who was crippled needed the power of the Holy Spirit in order to help him to be able to walk. And this was so amazing that the power of the Holy Spirit was able to heal him and he was able to walk. And this is where we get our big truth for today. You and me have also been healed by the power of the Holy Spirit from our sins so that we are able to serve God. So we need to jump for joy and praise him in the same way that the crippled man jumped for joy and praised God because he was healed through the power of the Holy Spirit. In order to learn this big truth, you can head to our website if you're watching from home, or you can head to the back of the church if you're here in person. Um, and part of our activity for today is making some puppets, and perhaps you could use them to tell someone our memory verse that we're going to be reminded of now from Isaac. Yeah, you receive power when the Holy Spirit comes on you. Yeah, you will be my witnesses to the ends of the earth. Acts 1-8.